name's Guy Christensen, I'm the Creative Learning Director at the Duke's Theatre in Lancaster. Uh, we've been working in Preston for a while now and uh, we've partnered up with Shot TV uh, to deliver workshops uh, across the area. Uh, we've come along uh, here today to try and set up and support the setup of um, some DJing and MCing uh, and VJing projects. Ciao. to do, they don't give us fuck all. Just on Thursdays we've got something to do, chilling here. Anything else, we just chill outside this little shit shop. And if we're not here, fuck knows where we are. What would you improve if you had money? Uh, make smoking shelters. Make smoking shelters, make somewhere to chill, fucking do something good, innit? We'll make this open a few more days, get an Xbox banging in it or something. No, I'm not bored. This is something for the youth to do. I mean, you always see them hanging about on the streets and that. Well, if you get them in here, well, we have them in a controlled environment then, so we can teach them new things. Yeah. Just teach them other things that are better to life than going out all in trouble. There's nothing, absolutely nothing to do around here. I mean, this, this youth club here is open on a Thursday and it brings everyone together. They're all in the end, they're not out of the street. They've decided that they're bad, and don't get me wrong, they probably aren't that in some ways, but they've been, um, they've been goaded into behaving badly. This lot, when I first came, believed they had no hope, believed that they were bad and there was no option for them. Hopefully they're getting to a place where they think there is something for them. Mm -hmm. How's your little Thursday session out, do you think? Well, at least they're talking to us. We've, we've not had our building smashed up, we've not had any... Um, any robberies or anything like that. The kids are pretty great. They, they talk to us all. They, they engage in the activities we, we put on for them. But they decide what they want to do as well. Yeah. You know, we listen to them. We don't judge them. And we, we listen to what they're saying. It's not always in the best context. We need to maybe do a bit of work around how they communicate with yeah. other people. But if you really listen to them, they've got some really good community-based values. Mm -hmm. You know, they, they're, they're worried about the younger kids. They're worried about their families. And we just need to erase their aspirations and make them feel more hopeful. Yo, what's happening? It's an ID, an OT. Let's have a little talk about what we need around here, why there's problems and everything. It's more, it's more because we don't, have, we don't have a lot of things around here. We've, not, we've always been blocked out, we've been pushed out of everything. And um, every time we try and do something positive, 
don't get recognised because we can't get any money for it. So then it's just flopped after like two weeks. It's stopped because we give up because we've no money. So that's why we're trying to do. We're get, trying to get everybody on music and everybody's on it. Like inside now, there's people doing the thing, learning, doing it, learning how to mix everything, doing everything right with basic, basic equipment that's broke as well. So we need. We got. We could do with a bit of money just to get everything up and running get more money into the system and then we can go on to bigger things and keep everybody off the streets because they'll be in here doing the music for the community. So half terms coming up in it for the yeah, kids, yeah. What, what what normally happens half terms, half holidays? Term, they, if there's nothing on the DOS about outside the shops there, um, then there's police come for nothing. You could just stand outside there and just have a talk with your mates and they come and talk to you for nothing and try and try and right, hassle you and everything. We so. even caught them hiding around bushes around there and looking at us yeah. for stuff we're not even doing. Like, yeah. And the time we do get recognised is for bad things. So it seems like when we're doing positive things, we don't get noticed, but when we do the negative things, everyone knows about it. Yeah, I know it. Uh, the problem that we found is that we're capable to come in, deliver a town-specific project, but then due to funding, due to our resources, we then have to leave. So what we aim to do is enable the young people to bring their own resources together, own it themselves, we'll give them the skills to facilitate the sessions, uh, and then they uh, can deliver it to their, to their peers and to the, the younger members of the area.